So you're putting together a front drive system and someone asks you, what's your water pump flange to balance or face measurement? I always get a few questions on that. I get asked, what is that? How do I measure it? And what's even the purpose of that? I'll cover all of that in this short clip. Firstly, what is it? This is the distance between two planes, the face of where your water pump pulley bolts on and the face of the balancer where the crank pulley mounts. It's how we figure out the proper alignment when we're mixing matching engines, pulleys, and the brackets. Secondly, how do I measure it? Use a straight edge and calipers. You lay the straight edge across the water pump pulley flange so it hangs in front of the balancer. Zero your calipers on the straight edge and then extend the depth rod down to the face of the balancer. If you don't have any calipers, a framing square and measuring tape works too. Just make sure you're measuring perpendicular and straight. Lastly, why does it matter? Because nothing about old school engines is consistent. GM small blocks had at least three different water pump styles. Ford small blocks, same thing, plus multiple balancers. Now mix in decades of aftermarket parts, swaps, and rebuilds, and your engine might not match any factory spec. Getting this measurement right ensures your accessory drive aligns and works as intended. And that's the meat of what you need to know about your water pump flange to balance or face measurement.